the final race of the week then the Doug Warren race in Maiden at Newcastle seven furlongs two year olds top one anything is possible Obi one ghost zapper ghost zapper hit the floor Leon Van Rensburg cryogenics Paul Rose Molly at steps Molly at surfer speed storm Mayor's Ad Mystery St. Heller SM Fitcher Backer Queen Jim James Follis Broken Dream David Robertson Daytona Demon Martin Leadham Dirty Hashtag Stu Gray Hellcat Graham Clutterbuck Holiday Town Jim Murray J.R. Livy James Wheeler Capdor Vitachi Doug Warren Lunchbox Legend Django Middleton Beat Alex Cherry Miss Fortune Hands Queen of Hearts Derek Hinton Smallpox Carla Agante Smash the Zoom Joshua Sutherland The River Darren Thompson and Zvezda Jamie Hopkins they're all in then big field for this and away they go closest to us looks like Lunchbox Legend and as they sort themselves out they're going to split into two I think with just the three coming over this side Lunchbox Legend Middleton beat and the grey ghost zapper so this could get messy Miss Fortune right over on the far side is the leader with Queen of Hearts Speed Storm Captain Vichachi trying to win, win the race for Doug trying to win his own race but it's Miss Fortune who is the leader from Capdor Vitachi and Queen of Hearts then Speedstorm and Holiday Town Ghost Zapper leads the group over on which is now the far side and Miss Fortune is the leader Miss Fortune is the leader we lose them behind the trees there Miss Fortune is the leader from Speedstorm and Holiday Town then Queen of Hearts Capdor Vitachi and Cryogenics Ghost Zapper the leader on the far side but got a lot of ground to make up they pass the three furlong pole race Miss Fortune is still the leader from Capdor Vitachi Ghost Zapper now getting into overdrive on the far side but it's Miss Fortune who's still the leader from Ghost Zapper running all by itself. Queen of Hearts, Holiday Town, Cryogenics in the river, then Molly at steps making a forward move. But now on the far side, Ghost Zapper takes it up and then coming down towards the furlong mark. Ghost Zapper has gone into a clear lead. The river's trying to chase in second. So it's two Molly at steps and Holiday Town and Hellcat. But you knew this was going to be a good one when John Morgan called it Ghost Zapper. And it's two, three lengths clear, racing up towards the line. Comfortable victory. Ghost Zapper takes it with a second. Holiday Town, third Molly at steps for Lunchbox Legend was far on the field trails back to back a queen it was ghost zapper takes it for ghost zapper john morgan the river for darren thompson second holiday town jim murray third molliette steps for molliette surfer was fourth and lunchbox legend for fifth was django's had a good opening week but that was probably the easiest winner to tip of the week i would think